Fargo Can't Park. That's the name of a Facebook group with over 2,000 members. The purpose is to share pictures of bad parking jobs. While it started out as a joke with clever captions, for some it's putting a serious problem in the spotlight. Valley News Team's crime and safety reporter Nicole Johnson explains. You have to be between the lines to avoid a parking ticket and to avoid being the subject of a post in this Facebook group. It's called Fargo Camp Park. Hundreds of members are snapping pics of poor parking jobs. This one's caption, yeah, those lines are really more for decoration. Just by not being courteous to the next person, you end up not getting enough spots. The creator of the page tells us he meant for it to be funny, saying people are taking it too seriously and too mean-spirited. But posts like this one of a handicapped parking spot is bringing up a larger issue. People don't stop and think until it affects them. This is Stephen Elf. You did work on me to TNT. <laughs> and his mom, Barb. They often have trouble finding open handicapped spots, saying people illegally park there, and they're asking you to imagine a walk in their shoes. It may be just a minute or two and a time saver for you, but for people like Stephen, it's independence. It can be the difference between them getting to do their tasks for the day or not. I've even had to snap pictures with my phone in order to get something done. To get something done, I've even had to call the police on. And those lines between the handicapped spots yeah, that's a loading zone, and you're not supposed to park there either. So I have to squeeze this monster of a chair between cars. Their own convenience seems to take precedence over consideration for other people, doesn't it? Their message, handicap or not, take a minute to think about other drivers before you park your car. And the members of this Facebook group might appreciate it too. In Fargo, Nicole Johnson, Valley News Live. In Fargo, if you're caught illegally parking in a handicapped spot, your ticket will cost you 100 bucks.